Hey guys, uh, on my way back from the lake and uh, got to thinking about something that I saw multiple times out on the lake. And that is people playing Russian roulette with their lives. Let me say that again. People playing Russian roulette with their lives. So what am I talking about when I say that? I'm not talking about unsafe boating acts, doing this and doing that, and, and that falls into that category, but I'm talking about really playing Russian roulette with their lives, and by that, I'm telling you, I'm out on the lake fishing, and I saw a lot of people in boats running at a high rate of speed, or even at a low rate of speed, not wearing a personal flotation device, not wearing a life jacket. I, mean, I don't understand the, the mindset of these people that don't wear a life jacket. Listen, I can tell you about this from personal experience. I was in a boat wreck at 94 miles an hour, 94. And guys, I'm telling you, it happens just way too fast to be scared in that instant. It just happens too fast. We hit, you know, we hooked that boat twice. I was the passenger. We hit that boat, hooked that boat twice, and we hit the bank, and we hit the bank very hard, and then by some, by some divine intervention, some miracle from God, neither one of us were injured. Neither one of us got hurt. Pride was hurt. It just happens too fast to be scared. But afterwards, man, I'm telling you, my legs were shaking like I had been electrocuted. So I'm, I'm begging you, put a life jacket on. Listen, and not only that, but, you know, I've seen videos of professional bass fishermen who are required to wear a life jacket during the hours of competition. But I see them out on the lake in videos, fun fishing, and not wearing a life jacket. I don't, it, is it that much of an inconvenience to wear a life jacket? You know, I, I got a friend who, when I would fish with him, he would not wear a life jacket. And I would tell him, hey, Dude, put a life jacket on. Dude, put a life jacket No, no, he wouldn't do it. And finally, we got out there one day, and, and I told him, I said, Dude, I said, put your life jacket on. I said, you finally got you a family that loves you, and you can love them and take care of them. What's going to happen to your family if something stupid happens and you die because you didn't wear a life jacket? Who's going to take care of your family? Who's going to take care of your family? Guys, you, you owe it to yourselves. You owe it to your kids to wear a life jacket. Your kids need a daddy to come home to. Your kids need a mommy to come home to. Your brothers and your sisters need a brother or a sister to come home to. Put your life jacket on. Stop playing Russian roulette with your life and put a life jacket on. Okay, so that, that's my rant. Uh, it, just, it just baffles me that people want to do stupid stuff like that. Put a life jacket on. I don't care if you're in a bass boat, a pontoon boat, a pleasure boat, a John boat, put your life jacket on because your life matters. You are important. You are important. These people that are in your life, to them, you walk on water. You hung the moon. And so you owe it to them to make sure that you do everything in your power to take care of yourself on the water. Put your life jacket on. It just may save your life.
So anyway, I've done said that's the end of my rant. Well, that is the end of my rant this time. So maybe I'll see y'all on the water somewhere. Uh, if you do, say hi. And uh, if not, it's all good too. So again, God bless you. Love you. Take care of yourselves.